Hey everyone, well, it's time for monthly prayer. We do this on the first Wednesday of the month at 7 p.m. As a church, we gather together to pray for about 30 minutes. However, if you can't pray that long, that's okay. Just pray as much as you can. If you want to pray longer, do that as well. We need prayer like never before. And so before I get off here and we all um, pray, uh, I want to share with you two scriptures. The first one's in Philippians 4, 6, a popular verse. It says, Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. The good news about this verse is that when it says, Don't be anxious about anything, I can leave all my anxieties through my words to God. So I can pray those things that, that I'm worried about um, because and that I'm in, maybe in anxiety about, but he will erase all of those and he replaces them with a peaceful mind. And that is what's so important. And that's something that prayer can do when we lay our burdens down before the Lord and he takes those burdens and we're able to have the peace of God within us, which is so good. The next verse I want to read is Psalms 102, 17. It says, he regards the prayer of the destitute and does not despise their prayer. In other words, the good news for us with, with what we just read is God listens to everybody. When you pray to him, he's listening. He hears you when we pray. It, it says, even it's the destitute God doesn't despise, it says, and does not despise their prayer. So he's regarding your prayer, regardless of what you think about yourself. And the enemy would love nothing more than for you to think low about yourself. Don't think low or that you're not worthy. Don't, don't think those things. If you've given your heart over to God and you believe that he's died on the cross and he rose again for you, and you believe that in your heart, you're a child of his then at that point. And therefore, he hears you when you come to him. Just in the same way as that my children come in the room and they begin to talk to me, I hear them. I listen to them. I want to talk to them. So I, we have some prayer points here. But before you pray for those prayer, into those prayer points, I want you just to lay your burdens down before God and just know and by faith know that God is hearing you when you pray no matter what. And then pray some of these prayer points. And for this year, our, our theme, if you will, for this year is to seek worship and obey God. Just that simple. And so let's do that during this prayer time tonight. Let's also pray for those who've contracted uh, COVID-19 and those who've been um, uh, economically challenged because of COVID. We want to pray for those individuals. We want the medical experts to have wisdom and protection for all of our members and for each one of us. Uh, which is extremely important as well. So I'm going to pray. And then when I'm done praying, you pray for as long as you can. And let's pray for our community, our church, and our nation. Let's pray. Father, tonight we just thank you for your word. We thank you that you hear us when we pray. And we also thank you that we can lay down our burdens and our anxieties to you. And you will replace that with your peace. And Lord, by faith right now, we just claim these two, these two verses for ourselves. Lord, that you hear us and you replace those anxieties with your peace. And Lord, I thank you that as we pray through all of these prayer points, you're hearing us, you're answering those prayers. And I thank you for giving that peace to everyone's heart concerning these prayer points and these needs and any other needs that, that, that we bring before you. Father, I know that you hear us and I thank you that you are faithful to complete it according to your word. Lord, we thank you and we praise you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right. Well, if you agree with that prayer, jump off here off of Facebook or YouTube, however you're listening, and pray for a while as we all pray together and in agreement. And that, that, that's that place of power. And we'll see you again on here on Facebook, YouTube, same way you're watching now on Sunday. God bless.